What up, everybody, and welcome to Brent's Porch. I'm yeah. Brent. Remember, Neek from last week, we had that hot discussion about uh, uh, Big Willie style. And we had two other friends. You've seen them before. You got Nakia and you got Fats. They've been on the porch with me before. But the porch today is in Limbrum because my porch is not that big. So, Fats. We talked about Will and Jada last week. And the kid don't, don't squirm. <laughs> and you've been posting like jackrabbits all across the Facebook about Will and Jada. So say what you gotta say here, because I'm curious. I know everybody wanna know what you think about the situation. I really think she shouldn't have to do it anymore. That is, that's pretty much her. She could have did whatever. But to just go ahead and try to justify it. I ain't never met a dude that tried to justify what he did. You call him. Whatever. Yeah, 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 it's over. We either going to be together or not. You can't justify it. Yeah, it's like this. I, I fell into it. I, 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 I. She showed me a better way of life. There's no other way to fall into that. So it's like, boom. All she had to do was say, hey, look, I'm bringing you to the red table, baby, to let you know that I made, I committed a sin, boom, boom, boom. Because ain't no such thing as open marriage. <laughs> I made it. Good to yeah. I, I, I don't, I'm not arguing with you. I'm not arguing with you. I, mean, I, guess, I say. committed a sin against what we believe. Uh-huh. But I'm like, come on, yeah. I, ain't no such thing as open relationship unless you sin. I, you know what? Uh... <laughs> so honestly, Jada Pinkett and Will Smith are so yesterday. However, yeah. mm-hmm. because you know social media only needs three days for anything. But I will say that I feel like the red table talk was a total waste of time for everybody else other than Will and Jada. Mm-hmm. So Fats and I we looked at a video about body language and it's this guy who's like a body language expert. Mm-hmm. And he was saying, like, you could tell that they came into this pre-rehearsed, like, okay, we're, you know, we're going to have this conversation. But there were so many moments where Will and Jada just, like, their, their body they language, that they, they, it, it couldn't be held in, right? So the moments where Will was, like, the laughing, the joking, and they trying to make it, like, this whole bad marriage thing. And mind you, I haven't seen it, but I've seen enough clips. I feel like Jada came to the table talking and was just like, yeah, I had an entanglement, like, that's just how we say it. And that was to me no, was I think she on a level of like, girl. She ain't want to say because it's rare that I ever hear a woman say she's I, it, No, we ain't saying it. That uh, time. I'm, not, I'm not touching that way. I don't hear women go, yeah, I cheated on this dude, man. That's just horrible, man. My boyfriend got involved. It was a whole man. Dudes, I, I done heard that since like Twitter. Yeah, you, I done heard stories that guns and all that just from that. Women, but, you would never hear those stories. But where that go? Generally, they always say when women cheat, they cheat up. I ain't never had a motherfucker cheat on me or cheat up, yo. Not one. There's always been some clown motherfucker, yo. It ain't never been a motherfucker that I'd be like, well, oh, they ain't got shit together. They ain't got shit together. It's like a fucking clown, yo. Yeah. <laughs> we all must look alike. All clowns look alike. The problem was the arrogance of it all for me. It was like, yeah, we just had a little entanglement. Like, it was therapy. Like, yeah. You know, I was giving him a whole lot of therapy. You know, that's... She, that's, she, that's, she, that's, she, she that's therapy, therapy like this. That, therefore, that, <laughs> that, that, <laughs> that, <laughs> therefore, <laughs> therefore, that justifies the entanglement. Like, hey, hey, it was look, the arrogance of it all for me. <laughs> she gave that bonga bonga. She gave that bonga bonga. She gave that bonga bonga. Hey, look, I was like saying, he did read some song the other day, though. And then that was the other That's thing. That's so entangled, man. I heard. I have ever you heard about it. Like, it's been four years. Oh my God. Over. That's like, I'm so in love, but perfect timing that you got a little song called Entanglement featuring Rick Ross. After the fact. Like, that she D, are y'all joke? Are y'all playing us? He snitched. But he didn't tell me. He didn't have a chance to go with them. Yo, he fucking snitched. She yo. wrote the verse two and three of his song. But for real, she wrote it. What was the reason for the table? Who was it for? Was for her, for, for her to make her husband no. look bad, and no, it, bad. It, it, it was to make her look better. That's yes, like, the whole thing made her look better. Like, oh, we was broke up. That's why it, 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 it was the same face. So, nah, she didn't cheat on. Oh, me. She, she was, was separate. She was victimized by the whole entanglement. 
<laughs> everybody, it was by, everybody else's fault. By the cracking. <laughs> I just don't like it. I didn't like it. And I didn't need it. I feel like quiet, that should have been something that they can't quiet, nigga. I spoke on it last week. <laughs> I, I guess we get a little spicy. And you get your hour. I get a little spicy and laughing with this because we've been joining on this drink yeah, all it's, week. It's a mess. It's a mess. I'm it's, sick of the memes. It's like oh, it's yeah, funny, it, but it's not really funny. Oh, the Dragon Ball Z. Like, the it's the, 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 the best memes to me. I'm like, yeah. Jesus Damn, Christ. Over them. So, so yeah, next, speaking of wow shit. <laughs> <laughs> to the West, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Don't, talk, oh, baby. don't talk about my man. He did a lot. Oh, you see your tweet? What's that? They want the other day. I screenshot him. I was like, I'm going to say this, and I'm probably <laughs> Listen, I always have a very unpopular opinion. I stand with Kanye to the end. I don't know if it's a Gemini thing. This the same I dude. Get it. He did I not get change. It. It's something about Kanye that I get. Every time he says something that's off to the, the moon, I still get it. <laughs> the whole Harriet Tubman comment, after I dissected it and got over the fact that I'm like, you're talking about Harriet Tubman. After I thought about it, I sat down and I thought about it. I listened to it again. Kanye, what you said wasn't all the way off. You you got us to escape. But what did we do after we escaped? Did we work go for work, somebody work else? For another white man. We worked for somebody else. So if Kanye had been allowed to really get out what he really meant, I think that people would be would be able to say, he gave me something to think about. Not necessarily you agree said, you with him. Allowed. He had a platform. Problem sure is, is that he, he doesn't know how to verbalize. But, see, but he, he don't but stay focused. He, 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 he's not brain. I, 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 I can't get behind somebody who I know is having a mental health breakdown. I can't find any validity in a crazy what a crazy person is saying. And the sad part about it is, unfortunately, <laughs> the media, they're going to sell a story. Yeah. It is to his demise that they're selling a the story because our brother is sick. Yes. He is gone. To Wait. even spew that because Kanye West understands you're going to get your chance hey. at winning. <laughs> Kanye West understands a lot of things. If you listen to his earlier music yeah. and his indoctrination by his mother, mm -hmm. he is well aware that what he says is based in fiction. Because the world was white. You're talking about slavery. That, that makes no sense. That's asinine to even say. She didn't free slaves. She just moved them to work for other white people. Well, you could only work for white people because white people was the only ones working. It was slavery. So where, who, who the hell else were you supposed to work for? But, but it doesn't make maybe, it wrong, maybe he he sent she sent them somewhere where they worked for a wage. Yeah, they were they got paid for it. That's, paid still for under, that's still under better circumstances of than being a slave. Of course. So he was saying it in the context of. She didn't. She did shit for slaves. <laughs> That's the context in which he spoke. So once you speak, uh, once you use that tone, once you take yeah, that right. tone. Fuck what you saying. But I think that's the problem with him. But that's the problem with Take your medication, man. No, see, his tone Take your medication. I'm not gonna keep disrespecting him, dude. Disrespecting him. Nah, because nah, nah, because most of your crazy people be the. Be the reason why you enjoy life. Listen, that's not nah, nah, hold on, hold on. Yeah, that might be crazy. No, all right. <laughs> oh, is he crazy? Oh, okay. I'm a Gemini. I, 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 I boy that you. Okay. You know what's crazy about him? When I was telling Key, when he said he running for president, said awesome. But I ain't say why I thought it was awesome because now I think she's understanding. I'm explaining what I mean. Talk about. I thought my first rap with a president would be more rap than being a politician. You can be a politician, but you can still be rap because he makes sense rap. He makes more sense in his music than actually talking because when he say something, just say, if he said that hurry and tuck me line or what he said in a song, you would have been like this. You wouldn't even, you wouldn't have had no arguments. So. Nah, you bro. He done said, he done said a whole lot of stuff like that in the last couple of songs. 
the last, last couple of songs. He the put, last couple of albums he's been no. on is fucking rock. He done put out two yeah. songs. They, they, they enjoy yeah. the gospel joint. Yeah. He done put, yeah. he done yeah. put out yeah. two yeah. songs in three weeks. Yeah. He, he done put out Donda. Donda and the other. Oh, and he Donda. put out another one yeah. called Washing the Blood Washing before the Donda. Yeah. That's kind of song right like there. If you listen to it, it's like this. Well, he's been talking about this for like four years now. And y'all didn't want to listen to it. So I ain't even going well, death about every, we, we we about what? what? He's been talking about a lot of political things, but he might have to say it in one minute. He, he know how to say Joey it in less than like 15 seconds. He has. I mean, yeah, but how you would say he's Joseph, right? That then go sit beside motherfucking Donald Trump. I don't. That's what I mean. His methods in which he moves, it, ch- it challenges his authenticity. How does it challenge his authenticity? Because how can you jump on TV and say George Bush does not like black people? Did and then get up there and say Donald Trump is your dragon twin. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know the relationship? I'm starting to not care about what the media perceives. What media is their relationship? I'm not, I, mean, I don't care what the media perceives their brand would be. I don't He's doing it in the media. That's what he loves. That's the only way we can go. Hey. That's what Kanye loves. But well. we also have to we remember that the whole thing in a nutshell is that we all can agree that there is something wrong. There is a mental issue, right? Yeah. So half oh, of what we're talking it? about is obsolete because half of what he say, he ain't speaking from his right brain. So, yes. yeah, so because of that, so I think that's why I'm willing to be able to accept Kanye. Because I know, look, dude, you need help. I right? think they need to shut the cameras off. Of exactly. I think there should be no more. His Twitter account should be shut down. Everything needs I to agree. be shut down. He needs to be. Are gone. you trying to get rid of somebody first? Of I'm getting rid of his first wow. amendment. <laughs> I think. I think. I, think I would he, snatch I think he his take a break. First I think, think that's gonna have break. Anyway, but black people keep on tripping. No, I think, I think he can take a say break. It. He needs to take a break. He needs to say take a break. That, he needs, take he needs his to his work on himself. Yeah. He because he's deserve, he deserves nothing but good he- mental health. Exactly. He's a father. He is a husband. You know, he's a family man. Right. Not his extended family. He deserves it to treat himself exactly. the way he wants to treat other people. He needs to take this time out right. and get the support that people are trying to give him. The people who are really close to him. Because people flew out. Yeah. I mean, and, and, keep, and keep in mind, this is the same guy who was in the most horrific car accident in the history. And who's to say that he didn't have any? Of course, he had damage to his brain. His mouth was wide shut. Mm-hmm. All these things play a factor in this. As we get older and we don't treat it, and you don't get the proper rest because you're in that industry you're just working, 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 putting out music. Putting out genius. And then trauma keeps Putting out genius and trauma, trauma's happening, trauma's happening. And it's, you're still pushing because you still got to make this music. Yeah. You still got to make this music. You don't know what you dedicated to at that point. Yeah. That'll crack the same person. So I'm not sitting here saying, like, write this nigga all. Do you think- I'm talking about as he is right now, mm-hmm. shut the cameras off. I do. I look at him. He, I- he just like everybody else can. Exactly. Positions to try and get Treat him like everybody else. Age. Turn the cameras off. Yeah, he need a break. Oh, we're still letting him do what he's trying to do? In politics? Still, no. I don't care whatever he wants. What, what do you off. really feel he's trying to do in politics? I don't think he's trying to I mean, to he wanted to make his group the birthday party. First of all, if you're looking at taking something serious, like, come on, man. Let's not even talk about it. Hold on, hold on. First of all, first of all, first of all, first of all, first of all. After this last president and half of this certain... <laughs> And I'm, not, I'm not saying out of the, 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 the presidency the president is not a circus right now. Because it is definitely a circus Trump with no tons of clowns. Trump, uh, no, he has and Trump, Trump is the ringleader. No, no, no. I think Trump, <laughs> I think Trump just exposed what it is instead of just going. Let, let me hide. No, no. Don't bring so, up the He exposed what it is. He exposed what it is because the after the black man, man after the American black man, American. they would have hey, voted any white man listen, in. We're getting him a make a man good, great again. He, he's an undercover Trump supporter. Go ahead, Fat. Me being a Trump supporter. No, no, I ain't vote for him. You are going to vote for him in 2020. I know it. Oh. You would never tell us. I think that's, you know. I'm a firm believer. I'm a firm believer in a. Let presidents right now let them get their hate. Let them get what? what? Let, let them get their hate. Eight. So you think that everybody should deserve deserves an eight? Eight? Even if it's horrible. Why do we why deserve people, eight? This, this okay. is a democratic republic. Okay. I mean, we the people, man. We cannot hold do on, it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I, I understand voting, but I'm I'm also understanding that if every president that had eight goes ahead and uh set whatever they trying to set 
fix up whatever somebody else did, that ain't gonna take four years. It don't matter what president you are. That's I, the way people talk. Barack should have got sixteen. The way people want you, you should have got sixteen. You know, in my opinion, just fucking after this presidency, after forty-five, I'm I'm willing to cut it down to two. I'm willing to cut it down to none. Can we go a couple of years without anybody? <laughs> Can we do it? We need a whole lot of just Can free ball it as a country. Exactly, free ball it. Right. Yeah, let them get a. Let them try to do what they want to do. And, and implement the last president or change what he wanted. And keep it going to the next person. So you think that each person needs to have a minimum time? Yeah, after all the times and all this voting, we know they just put people in. President of the country. They control the money. They're CEO. They don't really do nothing. A CEO go to different places, have meetings, make sure we can have trade agreements, make sure. That's what a president do. He runs the country. What happens when you have a bad CEO? He bankrupts the company. Okay, okay. Right? Okay. <laughs> so do you get what's called the bad people CEO that hired the CEO, the company? The people that hired the CEO do you know the that he does do. He has a professional career of doing this to himself. So they do it as own. But I think it's backfiring because it's not working the way they th- thought it was going to work. Well, I didn't think it was going to work. They thought he was going to make America great again. I'm, Trump, I'm, 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 what am I just saying? <laughs> I'm just like this. As far as Trump, I haven't seen nothing or heard him say anything to be me believe anything that anybody has spilled out before I stopped paying attention. I just knew he was gonna be Trump. He, am I lying? You I said when he was gonna be president, he's going to be apprentice Trump. He's gonna be Trump. If he's gonna anything this, other than that, like I'm gonna be shocked. He run the show like the he run the country like the president. Like I'm gonna say that's, that's I was, about right. I was. Did you find that is true? I was yeah. expecting that. Anything he else? Run the like the stuff, him being racist. Don't see. You. Don't see. You know. <laughs> I don't see. Hey, look. So, are you saying you don't think he's, you don't think he's racist? You think he's just pandering to the white racist that they vote? Is that what you tell me? Is that what you believe? I mean, because there's definitely some racist shit going on. Well, that's my white shit. That's my white shit. There's racist shit going on. That's my white shit. Maybe he's just prejudiced. Maybe he's just being prejudiced. No, I did not say that. Maybe he's being prejudiced. Prejudiced with his vernacular. That's not what I said. Like being a jerk about the way he talk about things. But you the leader of the free world. You can't be a jerk when you talk about things. Wow, really? You can. My I favorite can. president of the free world was George W. Bush. And my man has won flawlessly every time. With but the there's a difference. Let's we'll see if that's go back. Because there's a difference between George W. and Trump. The difference between George W. is you. We didn't like George W. because of his policies, his stuff. We yeah. didn't necessarily not like him because of who he was and how he talked. We don't like Trump yeah, because as soon as he wasn't a president, you know, nobody he was, had no yeah, beef for him at all. Right. Like when Trump leaves office, everybody going to look at Trump. You look every he's sideways from here. People didn't look at Trump seriously before presidency because he wasn't a president. He yeah, was a CEO. Yeah. He could play. He could be stupid. He could hang with Oprah. He could be with everybody. But as soon as he became a president, it time, changed. It changed, 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 and he sh- he should have changed. He should have said, "Okay, I may grab them by the whatever, but now I got to say it a different way." If I'm gonna say it at all, but he needed to change. He needed and, to become a president. He needed to become he right. He, was, he <laughs> is incapable of becoming president. What, pre- what president don't lie? No, he's not a, talking he's about lying. He's, 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 he's not presidential in right. his mind. Right. You have to politically finesse yeah. a lie. Exactly. He, he's not. Nobody he's not listen. Nobody is. For me personally, I don't give a fuck Democrat, Republican, all of that shit. I don't really care about. I don't give a fuck about that. They don't support nobody exactly. anyway on both ends of the exactly. spectrum. So I'm not even speaking from the political part of it. We're talking about his character and his job title. They don't mix. Right. They don't mix. Even if other people have horrible politics or they fucked up in the country. We knew what we didn't know because they at least had the political graces. I, I think I think to smooth us and not to be fucking panicked. And I think that's why <laughs> he's changing a lot of things that's been up for a long time. Like what? Like what? what you See, saying? this is what you're saying. When he comes to different countries, when he do, he don't come like that same pattern and stuff 
that people expect. He coming in like this. I'm gonna talk about dollars. Ha ha ha! You stupid. You stupid. You stupid. No, he ain't stupid. Yeah. No, he uh, can't trans for people just leave. How is that helpful for the country? How, 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 how is that helpful? When did, are we at war? Are we at war? Are we at war? Are we at war? We we're we're the we're always at war. No, no, no. The whole world is at war. Have we ever not been at war? Have we been at war? I ain't been seeing war. Well, yeah, it's it's war. It's it's war. It's it's war that happened under yeah. Barack. He didn't start it. What the hell war got to do with his Nothing. character? Yes, we talking him about him as a character. person. Okay, look. What does okay, his character have to do with him being let's, president? Let's discuss. Because let's, you are the leader of the country. Let's discuss what we can agree on. We've agreed that there are some things. we can, And I can't be specific at this moment, but I can get specific and we can put edits at this if you want to. That there are some policies that have been Past, put into place that we can say they will always be under the Trump regime, right? What if they were good? Whether they were bad, we, there will always be like this. Okay, Obamacare, we know that's under Obama's regime, right? Trump is going to have a couple that is going to be good for somebody, right? We can agree on. When that. is he going to make any though? But I don't think that's going to ever happen. He is going to pass things that other people present. I don't think that Trump can genuinely, in his own being come up with something that he could pass that's going to be logical to America. <laughs> and I'm going to tell you why. Because, yeah, yeah, yeah. I will, I because will agree with somebody like that he shouldn't have that job. I agree. He sh I don't think he should have the job. Well, see, but he does. Be, be right? paperwork and just go, make sense, don't make sense, don't like that, go. What I mean, I'm buying a fucking Make America Great Again hat. Yeah. I'm telling you. <laughs> I, think, I think the only thing that Trump hat has done for me is made me want to look again. into policy procedures, all of that stuff more because it's like, if this dude can do it, I know I can sit back and read it and really figure it out and understand it. Like, I don't care about Democrat, Republican, because none of them, to your point, have anybody's real true interest at heart. But I, I do so. now research more about politics, if there was one point in time, and we could probably, I don't know, I could say for myself, I didn't really care. I wanted to know who the president was. And yeah, now he, I know he, that he the president- He made everybody want to research exactly, to it. Like, you, you want to research. What the hell is going on here? Yeah, you yeah. know it can't be that off, off the wall. Right. You know shit, you like, but nah, the thing, man, but the thing that ain't is, right. They don't sound and, right. And that's what I say with Trump being president, there's no more veil no more about how you look at politics. He did not, he went just like this. He went like this. I can prove to y'all you cannot go to high school and graduate and become the president of the United States of America. No, I think he just proved white privilege. <laughs> even with uh, that, ooh, even uh, with that, a nice thing uh, even, white even with that, Woo. even with that. I mean, oh my God! No, no, no. Don't be that with time. No, 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 He's about to go to that with that. Hold on, wait a minute. If if, Jesus. If, if, look, if 44 did one tenth of the shit that 43 did, or they do. Damn, <laughs> damn, uh, hey, hey, look, why right? you would have lynched him, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, but they, but they, hey, but he had to sacrifice from the other. What? What? He, he was that president, the one you like, you like presidents like that, but doing things. Where you think Who's the say I like Barack's politics? You were making an assumption. No, I, I, was, I like I, I his character. About, okay, as that's what I said. I said hey, look, he, could, he, he couldn't even get half the shit he wanted to pass, you. but there was blocked any fucking way. Every, but time. every time he tried to get well, anything passed, it was blocked. I and I hear some of people say, yes, "Well, he didn't get shit passed because he think he wanted to get passed." It was blocked. Because the stuff she was getting passed wasn't his majors. The stuff he was trying to get passed. Come on, man. What was he trying to get passed? Oh, it's tons oh of shit. Oh my God, healthcare. This man's the healthcare part. Hey, look. Yeah, hey, hey, look. You know, the hey, look. By the time the healthcare policy passed, you know it was worth the fuck down, down. Yo. Hey, look. The, the healthcare, but Obamacare is not what the fuck it started out as. No. It was worth the fuck down by the time they passed. I know. It, they wanted it to be super Kaiser Permanente, but no. Super Kaiser Permanente. <laughs> they wanted it to be a <laughs> super version of it. He's getting to make America great. Is this that simple? Give me one. Give me that show was in graffiti, yeah, but I don't support it. It's just like America great. I don't know. For who? Oh, for that whole phrase in and of itself is. Okay, you can't say that we had, we, had, we had a big history lesson two days ago. Show me that, man. I I fast. Uh, I don't know why you said that. Hey, look, since you didn't think make America great again, 
and tell me when the fucking great book. This has been several times we've heard that. I'm listening. Oh my god. Huh? I'm like, you got my attention. You, know, just, it's you got my attention, yo. It's just like, it's just, it's I, just had that, several times. I had to think about it because we look, several at, black we look at black folks that go, <laughs> see, but y'all make jokes about that. And it took me a long time to like get, like, keep like, you don't be caring about people's feelings. Okay, let me you start caring about people's feelings. Let me, let, me let me start. No, I'm talking about as far as understanding where people come from. Okay. Because it's like this. I've been looking at black people all day. If he keeps telling me I don't know what racism is, I don't know what you're talking about, and I get upset. Why am I getting upset? He don't know what that is. So if I say something about black people being great in America, especially during slavery a little bit, it wasn't great, great. Oh but it's the same thing. Are you okay? Okay, let me let me make sure I understand. Oh, okay. 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 I think what you're trying to say. Oh, yeah. <laughs> because okay, because okay, I, I understand what he's saying. I will say that there may have been several times where there were opportunities where we were great. Those times being Black Wall Street, we were great. That time was great. Now that was a time period that didn't last long. But we were great. Now, 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 let me not let me make it clear. I'm not saying that these things were not destroyed because of outside influence. Even with the of political you know. party, I'm just saying that at those moments there was great. We also know that, know that the Durham massacre happened clearly because we were doing so great as Black Republicans. We had so many offices. We held so many positions that they came and killed us all. I didn't so even that, know that was also a time when we did. were. I we had to be it. doing something great. We had banks. We had everything going at that time as well. So I'm not saying that these great moments. Matter of fact, I shouldn't even say they were great. They were moments. That we did have, that we they should were contributions have. to American, true to yeah. America. But family. some, but in, other, but in another like, night, that, that would be that great American moments. Americans, and, and that's the bottom line. Like and, you said, and, we were we were building economies like Americans, true. But we were not ever treated as Americans, and that was the problem. Had they started treating us as Americans, we could have continued to thrive. But the right. threat, the threat of how successful and resilient we were and how we were able to contribute just as much if not more to the American economy without their help what in- infuriated them. Of course. But that also means that we had to be great at it in order for and we've to been be great at many of things. That's right. why the oppression exists in the first place. You're not going to oppress people that are really not great. True. You're not going to go out of your way. You're not going to go out of your way to oppress people that you think are mediocre. True. That's true. So, yeah. But this still goes back to the question. Like you said, make America great again. And I'm trying to try and figure out what was this so great for us? Because you got a moment. Do you really think that, do you really think do you really think that's a moment that he's speaking of? Who? Trump. No. That's you. I don't know, you, because it's a, it's one of those questions that is just he wants to make America great, and everybody's first question is what? No, no, he is make like, America great again. I Man, think you that said that make America great. great. Period. <laughs> okay, either way, he either could, way, make America honestly, great again. He was smart. If if he was smart, he would have left it and make America great, because then people could have thought whatever they wanted to think. Right, and it more people would have been about it. And more people would have been about it. That again part well, again is like it's a trigger word for black exactly. people. Exactly, it's like again, it's a trigger word a tr- for, for Native Americans. It's, it's a trigger yes, word. I agree. I agree. And it was intentional. Yeah, because you have to placate a base that's going to elect you in there. Yep, we are not the base that you placate to. But you know, it's a little. I, 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 I don't think y'all hear me. He's, oh, yeah. changing, he's <laughs> changing the the game of of elections and presidents stuff. Yeah, it's yeah. way different. Like I said, he yeah. the so, so, now, so, so now, I can be a, now I can be a shitty person and still get elected nope. president. Nope. I'm sorry, nope. hold on, hold on. I can be a shitty white person nope. and still get elected nope. president. Nope. Nope. Because a shitty black person would yeah. never see, be elected like president. See, no. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck how much money he got. Do you understand what I'm saying? How I've been doing this for this week and in the last week trying to figure out how to have conversations when you don't mention race. It's impossible. Nope, it's very possible. Because the problem is when you take out it's like 
my favorite thing to do back in the day was this. Watch TV without the sink. Why? You'll get a d different uh, perspective every time you watch that show. Okay. Fair. I watch TV without the sink. No, no, but I'm just saying, do you zone out? Because sometimes watching a perspective every time differently, you, you get to hear it. So the first thing, like when you say trigger word, like uh, make America, what do you mean make America? <clears throat> He didn't say nothing else. We shouldn't automatically get mad about it. We shouldn't throw race into it. Just go, hold on, let me sit back and listen to what he's saying. Uh, who was we? Who was people. We? Who was we? People. Because we people. You, you know what happened? The same people that you're saying made it about that, they didn't make it about that. The people who felt that again, the way it was intended, ran with that again. These political rallies for the first time in my history of living, became about something other than politics. That was the first time I had seen that. There's plenty of shitty presidents that's ran, plenty of presidents that's done harm to this, um, this marginalized community. Hey, hey, look, but this hey, time look, was that, different that, because these it brought rallies out all of the, the, felt like the, the, the racist, the Confederate like flag, flag kind of the swipe stick. Yeah. Yeah. All this People shit came out because of that. Motivated. He, he's, he's and also yeah. Sydney, he's we have to remember yeah. because of the fact that they used to have postcards about hangings. This they type of show. Yeah. When th these rallies became, oh, we we were like, oh my god, they were pushing yes. black people. When I saw that, I was like, oh, this shit getting real because at first, exactly. uh, we, and, and we, 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 we used to, that, right? we we used to the political banter. Right. I mean, you remember the Puff Daddy shirts, the bitch asses, no bitch asses. Yeah. We are accustomed to political banter. It is not uncommon that politics get a little ugly at times with the word of the mouth. I mean, but in this case, it struck a chord, man, yeah. that did not feel familiar to our generation. Yeah. Yeah. But our parents' generation, they felt the it, it, it triggered them, man, yeah. because it felt like something very familiar to them that they wanted very well, important and marched very hard well, for I, us I, to never feel. I'll say that me and my father don't agree on a lot of things, but we agreed on this Trump stuff. Because we both believe it's a game. It's a game? It's a game because, like I said, the stuff he getting away with is going to change future government. But, so no, now, but, but, he, but he's playing a game with everybody's life, bro. But that's what I'm saying. <laughs> but it's a game, but it's almost Are like Are you saying he's being used as a pawn? Is that nah, what you're nah, 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 nah. I ain't even going to say none of the president's pawns anymore. They know exactly what the fuck they do. I mean, as far as he understands They know what the job, bro.